Hibiscus lotion is just so much easier to make with the magical butter machine. I basically have three recipes for handmade lotion. My first recipe is really a really light moisturizer, perfect for summer, and I call it my handmade lotion with honey. That recipe will not work in the magic butter machine. My second recipe, which I use for my Magic Waters Comfrey Lotion, is richer and works well for the face, which I use under my makeup. I am 71, and this is what I call my beauty secret. The third recipe, which I call my Handmade Body Butter Lotion, is a super rich and moisturizing. If you love body butter, but do not like dipping your hands into a jar, this has a richness and moisturizing of body butter, but it's just thin enough to work in the airless pump lotion bottles. And this is the recipe in this video. Okay, we'll start out by making a strong hibiscus tea. Two cups of water, and I prefer distilled water, one ounce of hibiscus flowers crushed and weighed, and cover and simmer these for 10 minutes. And then you want to strain your hibiscus tea. Now, I like the Magical Butter Strainer. And yes, it is a big investment. But if you do this a lot, it's well worth it. Now, what I've used for years is in my second choice is a reusable coffee filter. And then other than that, you can use a tea strainer, cheesecloth, whatever you may have on hand. Okay, next you want to weigh 70 grams of shea butter, 70 grams of emulsified wax, 140 grams of grapeseed oil, or if you've watched one of my other videos, you could make some infused hibiscus oil and 280 grams of the hibiscus tea that you made up. Now just pour the shea butter, emulsified wax, the oil and tea into the magical butter machine. Secure the lid and plug in. Set the temperature at 160 degrees and set the timer for one hour. Okay, now while this mixture cools all for two to five minutes, you need to measure out nine grams or one teaspoon of vitamin E, one teaspoon of honey, one teaspoon of glycerin or hibiscus glyceride, which you would also call a non-alcohol uh, Tincture, and you can see my videos on making glycerides. Six grams of octafin, which is also called sorbic acid plus 2PF as a preservative, and up to 10 grams of essential oils. Now, I use a combination of orange and lemon essential oils since hibiscus has a tart lemon like taste. I thought about using essential oil of rose scented geranium since it makes a pink lotion but I decided to go with the citrus instead. Now you add these ingredients to your lotion mixture that's in the magical butter machine, uh, secure your lid, set it on the bland clean cycle. Now this does not add any heat to the mixture and it uh, blends for about two minutes. Now you wanna pour this into some kind of pitcher or cup that has a spout like a measuring cup and pour it into your lotion containers. Now, you want to let this cool completely before capping it. Now, you want to clean your containers with alcohol before you put on your labels. And I will put the ingredients in the description bar. But if someone will comment, I can then leave the ingredients in the comment section. Now, if you don't have a magical butter machine, I do have other videos on my channel on how to make homemade lotions. And you may ask, what is an herbalist? You might be an herbalist if you grow at least one herb. Like, subscribe, and share.